Lobby Tools, Florida's legislative intelligence company. Subscribe today to Florida's leading policy, budget, and campaign tracking service. Request a free trial today at lobbytools.com. In 2014, the late Senator Dorothy Huckel filed a bill that would require high school students pass a half-credit financial literacy course in order to graduate. She told us it would better prepare students for the road ahead. They're going to be faced with these issues immediately. You know, what do I, how do I sign a lease? What does it mean? What does that debit card mean? The legislation didn't pass, but Huckel continued fighting for the cause until she passed away in October of this year. Senate President Bill Galvano says Huckel's relentless dedication defined her career in the Florida Senate. She was a very determined person, and when she put her mind to something and she, she would pursue it, and she felt like this should be a, a mandatory part of, of uh, curriculum. Next door to the office Huckel used to occupy, the legislation has been given new life. Yeah, Senator Travis Hudson to filed the Dorothy L. Huckel Financial Literacy Act in her honor. It'll be a very emotional day, uh, much like today honoring her will be, but it'll be a very emotional day should we, should we be able to get this through. Last year, after returning to the legislature following a bout with cancer, the Senate unanimously passed Huckel's financial literacy bill, but as in years past, a compromise couldn't be reached with the House. It was Huckel herself who was unwilling to compromise, refusing the House's offer to offer the course as an elective. Senator Huckel wasn't about compromising and would always say, I'll do it next year. Senator Hudson says if the bill passes this year, it'll be the version Huckel fought for until the end. In Tallahassee, I'm Jake Stofan.